Ah, uh, hello guys! Welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Gen 1 Rando Solos. We're going to be doing Nidoran Female today. So, before we take a look at this stat, you might be able to see it there. First and foremost guys, as always, we'll check where we placed up last time in the last run. And, uh, goodness me, it was a really, really fucking good run. Oh, one moment, just need to move this. We ran Jolteon. And um, for long periods of the game, we were on, actually on pace um, with Gengar. That still leads the way for an absolutely... That was such a seminal run, man. On the eighth run, it did. <laughs> it still leads the way for now, uh, 6 minutes, 50 seconds. The gold standard of runs. Mewtwo in second, Alex in third. As long as things fell in place, and they did for all of them, I always expected them three to be top um, three, to be honest. But Jolteon is the best of the rest right now. It finished up a time of 1 hour, 12 minutes, 16 seconds. I think we lost one of the, uh, on one of the E4 or something at one point. Um, probably could have beat Alakazam. Uh, the in-game time was 1 hour, 8 minutes, 3 seconds. Uh, also fourth. There's something on the screen. No, it is. It looked like it was common between them two then. Uh, but anyway, we beat D4 at level 52, lower level land, Vicky Bell, Alakazam, and Gengar. Um, put on the notes there, high moon encounter, yeah, we had super repel for a while, um, but yeah, particularly like the first, until we got to the repel, that was on the ground floor as well, but we run into so many things. It was looking like one of the worst moons, thankfully we got super repel, um, but it was still a pretty slow moon, compared to the top three, maybe. Um, a few mistakes cost a couple of them in. Yeah, I did make a couple of mistakes. Played a bit rusty. Some wrong move choice, and etc. Uh, or poor movement. Doing things in weird orders. Uh, we also had a heavy miss encounter. I don't know why I put that. Heavy miss rate. <laughs> I think it's LL's title. Uh, but we did have amazing moves and EVs. Our EVs were insane. 11, 10, 15, 13. It's probably going to be like, the best EVs we've had of any Pokemon. And Jolteon's already a beast. Um, I think it shows with great speed and great special. That's the best Pokemon for this challenge. Because if you look down, Gengar, Mewtwo, Alakazam, Jolteon, Victory Bell, Tentacruel, they're all great speed, all great special. And then we have Machamp, Primeape, but then Vileplume, Articuno as well. Nido Queen drops out the top 10 and to 11th. Uh, top 10 time, it's just insane. So we can make top 10. It's going down and down. Lower and lower. We're well, now 2747 by Articuno. So we can make top 10. And I'll start Articuno, which was actually the uh, record time I'd ever done before this series. Um, the Articuno run that I did in Monotype, that was. That was about an hour 20. Um, and that would only be like 7th or 8th right now. It might have been an hour 90. Yeah, I think it was an hour 20. So we've literally had 6 runs beat that. Uh, so yeah, Nidder Queen drops out the top 10. And... I expect to mention Nidoqueen because today we're going to be running its baby, Nidoran Female. We're going to be running, and it's the first three stage evolution on the very line that we've finished. Because we've also run Nidorina. Uh, we'll have a quick glance at Nidorina's sign. Nidorina did really well actually for a pre -ev. That did it in 151.22. Bit of a gap between that and Gyarados, but then um, gap between that and Oddish as well. In 20th place at the moment, in game time is 132.18, beat you to level 55, lost few men, didn't save state for Lance. That was dumb. I had to fight Lance twice, apparently. Got lovely kiss late on, though, and four optionals for drink, so I guess I got a late drink. Um, yeah, like, it, it has been fortunate that I've had run so many good Pokemon early on, but a lot of the great Pokemon we did get early drink, we did get good movesets, etc. I think the best case example of that not being the case, you can get a really good Pokemon that's potential for top 5 and just luck doesn't fall its way. Um, Gyarados is probably the best example and Nidoking, I guess. They, they're both times for them were surprisingly slow. I mean, they were both beaten by Voltorb, for example. So it does show that RNG can make or break runs sometimes. Uh, but Jolteon always had the capability of doing a great run and thankfully for us, we got the luck that we needed. We got Earliest drink. I think we found one in Moon. <clears throat> we had an insane move set, really good EVs, and uh, yeah, it was a pleasure to run Jolteon. I expect this run to take at least twice as long as that. 
Here it is, Nidoran female. It has 55 HP, 47 attack, 52 defense, 41 speed. It's very concerning. 40 special is not great either. It's enough to work with. I've run worse Pokemon, of course. I've run Kakuna, Matapod, and Caterpie. But I don't expect a great time from Nidoran. And I normally like to make like a, a target or a prediction. I think if we do sub two and a half hours, I'd be very happy. Um, but we're probably going to be looking at between two and a half hours and three hours, I think. If all goes to plan. We could get hard wall though. Anything like an Alakazam, Mewtwo, Mew, etc. Oh uh, god, that'd be awful. We want to run into the Weedles early on. We are medium fast level up group. Uh, we're pure poison type. So, probably start with some poison moves. Um, we'd have room for Nidoran, but I might as well put... Nido Female. Isn't that the female one? God, I don't even know. I never know that. Yeah, that's the female one. Okay. Rival, as have a rival name. I mean, the rival's going to have a Nido run as well, so we'll eventually end up with a Nido Queen. She's gonna be tough to deal with. So, here. Although, to be fair, it's Ground Moves the Typhus, so that will help. Um, but yeah, Gengar is the rival name, because Gengar is still, still the time to be, and it may well be forevermore, guys. Uh, Jolteon showed it is capable of beating Gengar, uh, well, we are capable of beating Gengar's time, but not manage it with Mewtwo, not manage it with Alakazam, etc. And Mewtwo had a minute and a half surge game, they probably would have beat it, and had a tough arrival, obviously, in Mewtwo. Yeah, we'll be looking at the likes of Zapdos, Moltres, Charizard could maybe beat it. Um, any Grassmon, like Venusaur, if it started with Spore, for example, could maybe beat it. Um, yeah, this run is going to be just... Uh, oh my god, what a start move set though. Holy shit. I'm a frozen, straight away. For fuck's sake, just hurry up and kill me now. It's gonna piss about. Oh, classic. We lose the speed tie and <coughs> get frozen, so we don't even get the extra level of the first fight. Not a good start. But uh, I do like that move, so that's Psychic Ice Beam. Holy shit. Our special stat's not great. It would be better running physical moves, but um, just in general, special moves are just better, man. We're so slow, though. We're not going to be able to outrun Jinx. We're probably going to die here. Oh, well, let me outrun, but it won't always. Uh, yeah, Jinx is not a good thing to run into in the first route. Well, level 2 though, I think I want to kill it. Maybe I'll speed. No, I'm dead. Oh, uh, Jinx's psychic moves are typhus. Oh, rip. I don't like seeing that. It's summonous, because Jinx could have been one of the better runs. I guess we'd have to target through the uh, other special moves to fix ice side. For fuck's sake, man. I never liked seeing Typhus that I'm not aware of or forgotten about. And I don't remember knowing that Jinx is psychic moves are Typhus. It's the same with Starmie. Slowpoke and Slowbro. So none of them will be as big a threat as they could be in this run for us, but um, still. Same with a lot of the ground move Pokemon as well. Low Cubone's evolutionary line, and Diglett's evolutionary line, and Rhyhorn's evolutionary line. All their ground moves work properly. Let's let me run. Let's go. I got the potion. Yeah. Fuck off. Alright, to be fair, don't mind you, Golbat. It'll be good XP and uh, should be a free kill. Yeah, it's bound to know a lot of poison moves, should you just shit. Bro, that goes up to level 7, actually, nice. Although we might have skipped a level of move then. Sweet. Bypass level 6. So, yeah. It's a bit going. <coughs> but on level 7, I feel confident enough that I could, I'll go and see if I can beat the level 6 trainer. No real point going to level 9 guy yet. I don't think we're going to have so much chance. Normally, if Pokemon is. 
average status in Nidoran. You, you have to pretty much fight everyone before Brock. Brock is often the toughest trainer after the whole thing. Right, let's go. We have got a really good couple of special moves there. Psychic Ice Beam are good enough to run the whole game. Load speed, for fuck's sake. A good matter, based on the second thing up. I think Kabuto special is awful. Kabuto would have been. Uh, no, almost all would have been worse to run into that. I found like Gust might as well instead of Poison Sting, but yeah, it's such a shit move. Reflect all you want, execute. Let's go. Nice man, up to level 9 already. Good shit, Nidoran. Maybe I can fight level 9. This would be a really quick start from a Pokemon like Nidoran. If we can get through. Thanks for that pretty nasty start a couple of special moves. They could carry us in the early game. Oh, let's go. We got a drink already as well. Good start. <coughs> well, double drink. You know what, I probably should have saved it before fighting this, because I might not be able to take out this guy anyway, and then I'll probably be heading back towards Verdi. <coughs> okay, let's go. Maybe could be, unless it knows Earthquake or something. Sure, Peck will still hurt, man. Ooh, let's go, around. Come on. What a start. 1 HP clutch. Punk it didn't double drill Packers. Rhyhorn's great XP as well. It's obviously a free kill. So, level 11. Still doubt we'll be able to stick on Brock, but you never know what kind of team he's got. I have two Weedles. Even if I can get through his first Pokemon, it might be worth taking death. Uh, but then I could always fight the trainer here. Still a couple of trainers in the forest. I'm rival 1A, I could go fight. Well, good start! Oh, let's go, man. Don't mind that. Of course. Oh, Gust's a normal move in this fucking game, innit? Fuck's sake. Really? Oh my god, we literally- No way, we just got killed by a fucking metapod. <laughs> we can obviously kill it. We just need to hope it doesn't use it. <laughs> I don't even have an X item I can sell for the next one, but uh, isn't it weak to Sludge? No, apparently our Sludge is typeless. Again. Fucking hell. It was the same with, um, that sort of run recently. Oh, the fucking crit. There's no point really taking deaths. Well, I was going to say, in farming Metapod. But its XP was actually much better than I expected. Uh, but nice, coughing's not a bad sight either. Psychic will pretty much destroy it in two, I think. I don't really think... I mean, I might as well see what this guy's got, but I don't really think there's much point to fight this guy. I'll get through Brock pretty quickly, in the next few turns, I think. We'll get and hit my chance of welcome sight to resist fighting moves. That's one shot. And that's great XP. Garlic would probably kill me though. Oh, I thought I might have lived the bite then. I think that was close. But yeah, level 13 now. I'm confident not to do this. I think we'll probably one shot that part with Psychic. Oh, Ice Beam would damage even more. Actually, Ice Beam's 95 damage, Psychic's 90. So we'll Ice Beam, and then Psychic, the coughing. Yeah, it should be weak to Sludge. I think it's Cypress. Mega Kick's fucking 1 in 4 to miss, man. Like, like, I mean, was it like last run or the run before? <coughs> I got Mega Kicked a lot and they never fucking missed. Oh, let's go, by the way. The special drop means we outspeed then. Because Gen 1 being Gen 1. Don't want to land Poison Gas, but uh, yeah, what a fast start that was for a baby Pokemon. It's probably one of the quickest. Rock clears we've done. Uh, might as well take some vice grip instead of 
ghost. Just a stronger normal move. Well, Vice Grip would probably be the next move to go as well. Keep Sludge for now. I maybe should have used Sludge on the Execute before actually, um, to test it. So maybe Bug isn't weak to it. I know there's some weird things like that in general. So, uh, and we can buy our four remaining escape ropes that we need. Yeah, it's a shame our specials are weak to start. And neither on male, we have actually slightly better base than average, I think. But it looked more geared up to a speedrun, so it had a better attack and better special. Nice special drop on Thunder Mist, though. Magnemite would have hurt, so it was a really good special. As does Pikachu. Its defense is awful, so go down on one sludge. <coughs> Speed drop's not good though. Oh god. Nice, toxic me all you like. No, they're freaking. No rest. Speed on Mother. This is going to be the annoying thing though. I'm going to have to stop it evolving fucking so much. So we didn't have that problem with Rina, of course, because um, you evolve it by Moonstone. Oh god. Jolteon does hit a lot of crits, we need that. Oh, yeah, this fight could be rough, man. We just needed to not under, uh, crit Thunderbolt, either of the two. It's only going to be 1 and 256 in this. Or we wanted to go for Thunder and miss. Not the Thunder Hit Crit, Jesus Christ. Oh, that one hurt. No, Thunder Punch isn't bad. It looks like Sludge is a range to it. Fuck off if you crit Jolteon. You know what? Even though we were Jolteon, we did see a fair amount of crit. Early game, we didn't actually see that many, I felt like. This one's hit more than I fucking did. A level 11. Oh, piss off, man. Mm, I was gonna say it'd help if I'm fully HP'd or I'd be using a soda pop for 2 HP, there's no point. Oh, oh. <coughs> Nice, nice, nice. Holy fucking shit, this move set's so good. Oh, we got the poison. Oh, fuck off, just miss a thunder, you son of a bitch. Ah, uh, this is slowing us down. Not a great Pokemon to run into. Jolteon is very good. 110 special, 130 speed. Oh my god, it's, it's hit four thunders in a row on me. It's 30 percent to miss, come on. I would miss two of those thunders for sure. I always seem to miss more than 30 percent of my thunders. Oh, come on, man. Even Fireboss 15 cents. Fuck off. Son of a bitch. It's just potion early. Might have to fight the trainer below here. I could still go back and fight some in the forest. Just to get extra levels. Maybe we go for a psychic special drop here. Or I could go for Ice Beam. And hope for a freeze. I'm pretty consistently getting one attack on it at least. Or any stupid crit. It still hasn't missed as well. It's fucking annoying. Or even like two non crit thunder punches, but. <sighs> then we get the 1 in 256 sludge miss. Are you fucking serious? 1 in 256. We need that a thunder punch for thunder ball or something. Finally. Stuff on the unfortunately got a crit from the punch, so I'm still weak. No 
special draw. I could still die in this fight. Oh, it hits the Hydra, but bro, they're just not missing these fucking inaccurate moves. Let's go, they're finally a free. Fucking hell, that guy was well held and bro. They don't often struggle on trainers in this route, but yeah, that was. They were a couple of really good Pokemon. They had powerful moves. Muk is more like it. I like to see that. Same with Tangela. Oh, I should use Sludge then. Test it out. Never mind. This is obviously a threat. Stall speed me. <clears throat> I'm a dead. One more attempt. Maybe it'll double pack me. Um, yeah, I could just put one the soda pops on. It's probably quicker to go back to the centre. It's annoying because it's the last fight before we get to the centre. Or I could go for the freeze. The special drop it. Mild speed. Bro, they keep hitting these really powerful and accurate moves. I mean, pop it. Just use our soda pop. Still got one left. The yeah. end. Cerulean to Saffron skip. Yeah, to be now going for Rock Tunnel. Still only one run as that's going for Rock Tunnel. Or Star, you know. Really unlucky. Oh, there's a double pack. You fucking see it. If I one shot the next thing, let me fume. Just wasted a soda pop. Which could have been useful for Misty or something. Fuck's sake. No, that's classic. <laughs> but at the end of the day, we're through. So I haven't got Repel for Moon though, but I hope we find some in there. Um, even though my moveset's pretty good right now, I'm still gonna look at both TMs. I mean, I have to go explore and looking for a drink anyway. So. What was our HM bitch going to be? Nidorino! Seems fitting. <laughs> it's done all Nido run. Let's revive and sell that. Fucking hell, I need to run that optional. What a great encounter rate that was at the start, by the way. This is like the path that Jolteon took, and if you run into all five things at this point, probably more. Really hurt it, could have finished like top three. Oh, what am I doing actually? I have a drink item? What the fuck? Oh well, we just picked up a K. That was a waste of time. <laughs> Heavy. Heavy salad. Kills about okay, we good XP. We'll look down here though, in case we find a repel. Ethers would be nice as well, of course. Okay, ready for E4. Ooh, iron, yeah, this is where. Free sort of fence. So, let's see M4, confusion, we have psychic, so there's no need for that. So. Psychic and Ice Beam, I doubt they'll go full stop in this moveset, it's pretty good. Oh nice, let's go, this is definitely worth it, we got a Super Repel. Some of Jolteon actually found a Super Repel down there, I think I will still go... I'll do the old save state, so we can reload our Repel steps if this is trash. But, but we'll uh, check the TM. So it's TM4 and TM3. Submission, yeah, it's worth keeping all over, I think. But doubtful teacher, I'm not a, generally a fan of um, 
recoil moves. Oh, he has good. Has wasted some more of our repel sets, but super repel should get us most of the way out of it. Still. Right, let's run out now. <coughs> it's still a really good start, man. Better than I expected. Nidder on. I didn't need a good move, so I've leveled up moves so far, I've been trapped. Oh my god. This isn't good though. It is if it uses try attack. Oh, nice crit as well. No, fucking hell, please don't crit me. Barely survived. Oh, let's go. Protein as well. Roiding it up. Increase our attack. Let's go. So I'll save state, you never know. I might be able to one shot all of these, but uh, I'll probably have to end up reloading and put the meat lemonade on. Rats is no problem though. Where is Bellsprout? Let's go. Oh, we'll learn and try attack, yeah. It's much better than Vice Grip. And yeah, that, now we die, I think, to seeking. Fuck, fuck it, it was only Bubble, like the weakest water move. Let's go. Saved on a heal item like, no. though. And as always, we get Lord Helix. Just, just a less step where we'd run into encounters. I don't even want to risk missing the 1 in 256 psychic there. <laughs> Tap him once, I'm sure. That's who would have killed me. The ball is pointless entirely. You can't even sell it for anything. We'll toss it. Some lucky fuck will find it. Oh my god, hydro pump. 1 in 5 to miss, and it's only 5 pp, so I don't usually teach it. Unless I end up getting walled by something like a Moltres, then we'll teach it. A lot of money in this run. And another Nugget Tune, of course. So, let's see if we can go do Misty straight off, because uh, we'll get another TM. Rock's Barge also increased our defense. Nice. Alright, where we go? We've got level 19 here, it's gonna be tough. 21 Pokemon. Okay, never mind. It's gonna be fine. That's puts me to sleep as well. I think one psychic should kill it. Uh, okay, it's looked just fine. These are really good starters. We got through Misty alright. Get to the mark. Get good TMs. We could maybe do sub 2 and a half. Oh, the fucking crit and the bear, no. Come on. We did lower Scarlet Special than Mardo, still going on speed. Uh. That was unlucky because we got the special drop as well. Maybe because it was burned we didn't do it. Lower the special again, nice. There will be to it. It looked like a range, maybe. Krabby should be fine. Oh, never mind. Oh my god. I didn't expect it to beat me, actually. Yeah, I don't even want to take a death there. Uh, Krabby's special is so bad that it'll probably go down in one psychic, but its attack's great and it knows Bone Club. So that is not ideal. Um, so yeah, let's go do Rival and stuff. We've come back to Misty. Not really ideal either, Seabra. Unless it spams Defense Curl. Look how good it's special is, man. Fair to odd. Nice special drop though. What we need to lower my speed, it's already trash. Doesn't. Oh my god, this is not a good team for us. 
new ice beam too, holy shit. I'm just getting frozen, I've got a full heal. We slowed it special, that was massive, that's the only reason we survived then. Like, just crit through it with the bubble. No, it's what's a solar beam mean, I'll do nothing. That's a crit. That was not a bad team at all, but I think we're gonna have fruit. Oh, he does have a Nidorina already though. Nice, the Ma, still one shot it. Let's go. So we'll have a Nido Queen by the time we get to um Pokemon Tower. Psychic for the win so far. The 30 percent chance of specials are off. It's pretty nasty. Not PP for it already. <laughs> Nice, I'm glad we didn't need it for Gravel Ivy. Yeah, we'll go and heal. For Psychic PP, we need it, evidently. Bro, I'm playing this at fucking 443. It's so dark. I hate it sometimes. The English summer is just grey and overcast. Cold. Right now. Oh fuck me, this is not good either. My size was try attack actually. Oh, of course it hits Thunder, just like Jolteon. Nice, I missed that one. It took like 5 Thunders for Jolteon to miss. Only took 2 for Raichu, frankly. Fuck off! Come <laughs> on! These electric Pokemon are so fast as well. <clears throat> I need to stop save Satan as I'm talking to him. It just seems it's quicker for the most part. We pretty much need to one shot this. No, we didn't. Might have to take a death here, I think. I've got a nugget on me, so it's not too bad. I would just potion mid battle, but there's always a danger Jolteon could still kill me. Just crit through or something. No, I don't even have any. I don't have the soda pop. Jolteon not wasting. Right, uh, Thunder could have missed then. I will have one more attempt, then just take it there. I'm definitely capable of killing this. I want one more. I want to at least hit it. Maybe go for the freeze. So you can't one shot with anything anyway. Oh, of course it paralyzes me. Yeah, let's take it there. Fuck okay. it. Fuck you, Jolteon. I always seem to run into the thing that I run last run a lot. It's fucking with me right now. I was loving it last one. I'm hating it now. <laughs> oh fuck it. To be fair though, touch wood, we haven't run into too many psychic Pokemon so far. The Mr. Mime obviously, but it didn't fuck with me too much. Oh my god! This, this fight's fucking awful as well. We really, really fucking got poke on there. And we're so slow, we got spared by poke. There's no disgrace getting out spared by Jolteon. I'm kind of surprised we got out spared by Magmar though. It's over. As soon as it paralyzed me, it's over. I needed to hit me with Thunder Punch twice. 
and not get a crit. Or just miss something. Go for thunder twice. Oh yeah, I missed the fireball. Please don't crit or paralyze me. Let's go. Thunderbolt did less than the force, would I think? Oh, the magma no slash. No way. Oh, it burned me. I crit that. And then Maltra. Oh my god, what the fuck? Holy shit, this fight's fucking insane. I haven't even walled it. I'll tell you what, we could go fight everyone in Misty's gym, at the least, the thing. Fight this guy. What the fuck, though? Like, Z Jolteon, Magma, Maltra. I just have nothing for fire. But, uh, to be fair, I have Hydro Pump. Actually, it did say, like, if we get walled by a Maltra, so that was an example. But this is not good either, we've run into a fucking electable. Gets the paralysis. Only got thunder shot though. Oh, piss off. Come on. Fuck off. Like, what the fuck? Paralysis does its thing twice in a row. It's 10% to paralyze me though. It's bullshit luck so far. Yeah, a couple of times we got stopped, but it's more just to do bollocks RNG. Like, the amount of attempts we've thrown at it, this shit shouldn't be happening. There's no way we should have lost that to Electabuzz. I was so unlucky. This try attack did way more than it did last time. They're doing that much damage with likes of Magmar Slash, Jolteon's Thunderbolt, or Thunder, etc., Fireball. There's no real point in even getting potions, and that's all I could buy right now. I regret using the lemonade so early. Definitely feel like we're capable of being missed here. We'll get another TM on uh, just an extra level will help. But yeah, I might have to see Charger Pump here. It, I want to keep Sludge for a while. We'll come back here about 3 or 4 levels higher. Oh, let's go. Great start. Oh, look, Mrs. Fireblast. Just every Pokemon seems to have a fucking really powerful move. Piece of piss then, though. As soon as we're able to bed, probably. Oh, we're getting Bone Club. I'm going to teach Bone Club instead of Tri Attack and Hydro Pump instead of um, thingy so we could Bone Club the Magma and Jolteon. To be fair, we can one shot Jolteon now. Okay, that, that was huge. Thank you, Misty. I didn't really want to get rid of tri or Sludge, though, but... Yeah, we kind of need to. Still full HP. We still need a bit of luck here, I think. But, uh... I might be able to get through now. But holy fuck, this is a hell of a team. Normally this route's never a problem, because, like... We're so overleveled, but given how shit our speed is, we're gonna be taking hits, and these are just god Pokemon, man. Will Bone Club one shot Magmar is a big question. It does, let's go. It's still the Mar, we're still gonna die. But I might just take the XP there and take the death. Moltres knows Fire Blast as well, of course it does. Uh, there's Stomp. If I could have just used Stomp. I think Hydro Pump will one-shot it. Such a powerful move. But yeah, this has been a weird save. Like, Misty and Brock weren't bad. There's just two random fucking junior trainers after them. I feel like I'm close to our speed Magma, at least. Bear me. Right, it's best case scenario so far. In terms of damage. Oh, why don't you stomp? Please don't flinch me. Oh, God. Oh, it's unlucky, man. Oh, finally, though, we're through. Holy shit, that was rough.
Oh, well done, Nader on. So we can get through that level 26. That was fucking impressive. Our moveset is nasty. Right, it's a fucking good job. Yeah, we didn't get a crit off the Jolteon. We've got Ember off Magmar, no burn. That was nice. No, the flinch was terrifying. I'm just running into so many good special Pokemon, and like... My moves are special, and my special stats are not good. We run run into physical Pokemon, and I just destroy them. Yeah, it kind of counts with our good star, just the random trainers. And I'm a bit gutted about that. Because the, the gym leaders, the rival fights, they're the ones you'd expect to be the top three fights in this first section of the game. Until we cut through and get to the Mar. I mean, I'm going to have to go to the Mar anyway, because uh, I need a Poké Doll still. Fuck off. You crit, tentacle. Oh, if the joke is fine, though. Thank God. Yeah, um Do I even really need to look at the Mark TM? So I mean I might as well while I'm there, I think, but this is a really, really good move, so. There's still plenty of other TMs I'm gonna get that like not as much on the way. Yeah, I don't know, I think I'll look. It'd be worth it if I got like Blizzard upgrade or Ice Beam, for example. I don't have any PP up, so... To be fair, would I take Blizzard? Because Hydra from only 5 PP as well. Psychic's only 10. Can't rely on Bone Club. Bone Club's 85% accurate, I think. There's me, weakest move. Oh, the 1 and 2, 56 again! On Psychic this time. What the fuck? Nice though, we got a crit to be fair, I made up for it. Nah, no, I don't want to land Power Dance. Let's try. Prior, I have to go for the light on when the ship's going. Don't want to waste any time, but when a ship sails away, then they run. A light on a 5 p.m. in a summer. <laughs> That's the most English thing. <coughs> yeah, definitely not gonna fight the optional guy for the TM. No need. It's a shame they didn't have this kind of move set on like a Gyarados or something. But at the same time, um, it's good to have it in a shit mon, I guess, because it won't be quite as long a run, although this is terrifying if I'll speed me. It did, and he used the wrong move. Fucking hell. Alright, we're still good. This phone club misses. Yeah, we've run into a lot of great Pokemon early on. Two of our top three there. It's fucking Starmie as well, Jesus Christ. Also crit me. The matter, Let's go. That was a hell of a team as well, though. Holy fuck. They are my three favourite Pokemon this gen, actually. <laughs> she's like... She's after my own heart, that trainer. That's, that's exactly the team I'd be running. If you could give me any free Pokemon for this gen. Gengar, Zan... Stormy, on my favourite three. Probably in the order of Alexam, Gengar, Stormy. So. It's really a shame that, like, Stormy, um, 
It's sidekick moves don't work properly because that's a runner I was really looking forward to. But it will get hindered. Psychic moves are typeless, but you could still get a great run out of it if you had moves like Ice Beam, Flame Throw, Thunderbolt, Crab Hammer or something. Probably shouldn't have healed there actually. I normally wait to heal at um, Cellar and then we can do the escape rope to the back. Splash. <laughs> Unlucky Sawyer. Best move in the game. Alright, TM is bite. I want that. So I have started getting a decent run of runs where um, we get an early drink. Not having to fight too many optionals. It's lovely stuff. I think I always over by full heals. We probably only need four for the whole one. <coughs> oh my god, we got Blizzard. Holy shit. Let's go, man. Oh my god, this moveset is fucking insane. Before we even go in the mall, I'm still gonna look. But, yeah, what the fuck? Like I said, though, I mean, I'm on an R in a bit now. Like, do we get rid of Ice Beam? Because then I've only got five PP for Blizzard, five for Hydro Pump below. That will go. I will replace Hydro Pump, I think. Even with Surf, if we end up deciding to teach Surf. Then we've got only 10 PP and Psychic. Oh, Razor Wind. If only that was Razor Leaf, that'd been really fucking nice. Yeah, I'm gonna keep all the Blizzard to now, I think. Crash, no, Waterfall, yeah, I might teach that. So it's TM2. Thundershot. Thundershot's weak, but I do love having electric moves. I would let you consider that then. Oh, drill fair. Really good. No. So I'm 9 and 2 so far. Hyper fun. So by TM2. TM9. I'm just gonna keep them on me for now, I think. Probably end up getting to a point where I run out of waterfalls somewhere. Uh, the hydro pumps and then teach waterfall. I'll also take out upstairs. I love Thunderbolt. I mean, the dream really was to get a physical move set with our stats. It's just we haven't really found the moves for it. Maybe we could get Earthquake or Dig would be nice. Is that Splash or Slash? Because if it's Slash, I'm teaching it. Oh my god, we got Thunderbolt as well. Holy shit. It was Slash. Bro, this moveset is insane. Mm, what do we get rid of here? Bone Club's nice to have. It really is. Maybe I hold fire on Thunderbolt. I do have Cavern kind of Ice Beam Psychic. I might get rid of Psychic actually. Yeah, it's a bit of a dilemma, isn't it? Or, do I mean, Slash will end up going, because we don't want it crit. And to be fair, with our shit base speed, is it... Are we gonna hit many crits through Slash? 
Might have been a mistake, but I could always get rid of it for T bolt anyway. TM18 was Razor Wind, that was the one I got for guys, so we got rid of that. Holy fuck though, we've got options, man. Some serious options. It's gonna be a good one. For a baby Pokemon, for sure. <coughs> Whenever you use a pal for these stats, I'm like, there's only so many. And I always end up running into something. I forgot we got rid of uh, Hydro Pump for a second. Yeah, like, yeah, I don't think we're gonna utilize Slash to the max here. No crits through them. If you crit Slash, it's almost as powerful as Hyper Beam. It's, it's so fucking good. Well, when on a normal Pokemon to be fair, I have Luck and Showdown, like, like Page, and it's not much off a Hyper Beam. But bear in mind, to be fair, Hyper Beam would then have a uh, stat boost as well, so yeah, it's pretty much probably the case of most Pokemon. Probably even more so for the likes of Nidoran, that won't get stab through Slash. It's just a fucking nasty move, man. Really good. Same as Razor Leaf. I love having Razor Leaf. Crab Hammer, etc. Alright, let's go. Rival. What have we got? Still have a Nidra, you know, so that won't be a problem. I mean, if I get rid of Psychic, um, I'm keeping Ice Beam the whole way, of course, because that's all moves to do with Nidra Green. I would do a Bone Club as well. Um, it'd be best to hit it with that. And the higher level I get, the more Slash will crit. Because our speed gets boosted. Oh my god. Holly, I got spared. Oh, we're trying to get a crit on. Probably didn't need that too. Fuck, I don't know. Yeah, we probably still would have killed Polly up. But nice, not a bad team. It's face. Much weaker team than his last one. I'm gonna go and put lights on <sighs> It's like stupid dark right now for how fucking early it still is. So I said you're going to freeze this room. In general, in this fucking playlist, it's been really fucking lucky. Oh my god, and again. Like, so often we've had quick surge games. The longest was side up, it took about 4 minutes, I think. Then the next longest is probably like Mewtwo, and like a minute and a half. Oh, good god, though, I didn't realize how weak it was. 
And we missed the Thunder Punch. Fuck's sake, we have to wipe. Oh, uh, it's not good. It's gonna take me all the way back to fucking Celadon. To be fair, I could just go and get Fly then. But I can't actually even use it. Oh, uh, lost. Actually, I'd spent almost all my money. To be fair. The Bone Club missed though. Uh, I'm surprised I even had sped my miss on. I didn't think I'd taken that much damage. Otherwise, I would have just healed. Yeah, a bit of a time loss. To be fair, could go and fight Erica now instead. Let's try that. I don't think I've ever beaten Erica before Surge in this playlist. What will have happened before? Fucking just casually throws out a zap bot. Come on. We might need Blizzard for this. Fuck off. He's gonna spam Fisher. Just the ground move. No, we just. Fate's inaccurate. We should be able to get through this. We just needed to miss the play. Oh, that happens. Let's go. We get the freeze. Be a lot of XP. I was actually a range to it. Amazingly. We we really high rolled the first one, or just low rolled the first two. Yeah, I think we're gonna get rid of Slash now for Thunderbolt. It makes no sense. We haven't hit too many crits. Our base speed's only 41, which is one of the lowest in the game. It is the most important stats, as you can see. We just take too much damage. Uh, I need plenty of potions in this kind of run. We're way too slow. Erica just turns up air back on us. <laughs> Couldn't act the defeat. She gets a side beam, but it's not really needed. Unless we get rid of Psychic, which I don't think I'm going to. That low kick can get sold. Sure. Yeah, let's go to Slash then. Fucking go. So I'm gonna have an extra escape rope on me, so. I can't use the escape route trick. I'm gonna go just go and heal them by million. Yeah, I'm still really fucking surprised I've spent the magnets on. How the fuck did I even do that? I was over level, not that much so. Oh, we gotta do this again. Alright, no, we chill. Let's go. I think we've wiped on Surge before. So yeah, I wasn't sure whether it'd still be open. Alright, please don't miss this time mid around. Fucking Blair. There we go, we got it. Oh my god. Fuck, we talk. Thunderbolt. Still might not matter. Oh my god, bro. Oh, it's a speed tie. Let's go. Unless it was using counter or some weird shit then. Fire blast as a TM, oh my god. Yeah, our options have been incredible. In TMs this run. Uh, what am I doing actually? Now I can teach fly and use it. God, I don't think we're gonna teach a single TM to a uh, Nidoran then, not even so. It's a pretty fast run, all things considered. Our stats and shit. Rival will get tougher now, though. He's going to have a Nidoqueen. 
so I'm gonna fall here before this fight thing. I don't just need it. With two fights over, well, three fights over here, and then we get to a heal area. Use Thunderbolt, I realized. Oh, it didn't matter really. Thunderbolt has more PP than Ice Beam. On the ball that's gonna take multiple hits. Oh, I'm fucking dead. Do you gonna go just destroy me? Or? Oh my. Oh fuck off, man. We're just so slow. I need to put next speed on or some shit. That's the reason I bought him early. But I can't really. I just can't, I don't think. I, I can't really take the hits of any of these things. No, oh, we need to. We kind of wanted to go for Hydro Pump and get the one in five minutes to fail. Oh, yeah, just spam Bubble Beam. Maybe if I heal. Get through Dugong, be low. Full heal. Maybe we could tank two Psychics and hit him on layer full HP. Now give me time to heal and put my X Speed on. And then we'll one shot over Psychic. Sure. Yeah, could I tank a Psychic here? Yeah, maybe. No, he still can't. Fucking hell. Not a good fight. I might have to go and get X Specials for this one. Have one more crack. Also crit me and lowers my speed. Might as well reload here. So that'd cancel my X speed. I was going to I was planning on putting on. No, let's do it first. Oh let's go, what a start. I have a chance now. That's a crit me here. Oh my fucking way, bro. This team. Nice. Was one shot though. I didn't expect that to be. Nice crit, Nido. Might well have needed that. Tentacle was really good. This is a really powerful team. Not got Nido Queen yet, actually. Definitely will do for Rival 5 or fight then. Um, but amazingly, we get through with no X specials. All we needed was that speed. Our moveset's so good. Still managed to kill them all. Yeah, it's definitely been a high quality seed this. In terms of what I thought. Alexam doesn't seem to want it. Use it psychic moon in screen. Never mind, it does. I can't believe we didn't one shot it then. There's a lot of shit in it around really. Is. We're gonna need to pull out heal on the Kabuto to stand any chance really. And probably put an X speed on too. Please don't let me speed. Nice. 
We should be fine now. I think we would even take tank a side beam, maybe. Given the level difference. Alright, well, we're chilling. Well, let's go. More steroids. Super. I already got maxes as well. Oh, I'm stuck in a fire spin. Could always use an X speed. Leave spam in this, I'll get stuck forever. Yeah, fuck this. Let's just use the X speed. There's been some scary Pokemon in this fucking tower, man. Holy shit. More things like Nidorino, please. It's obviously fine. I don't want acid armor. Yeah, I think we need to go back and heal. Three more trainers here. They have higher level than anything else in this tower. It's like areas I haven't really expected to slow us down in this run. I've slowed us down. Just random trainers. Just with insanely fast Pokemon, like strong special Pokemon. Bit terrifying, Kadabra. That wasn't too bad. Patience, terrifying as well. God, we survive. Let's go. Well, they're near the run. Fucking doing well. It's so shit, but it's, it's still doing well somehow. Well, okay, let's see this move set pretty much. The importance of a great move set can never be undervalued in these playlists. Even if shit is the Pokemon, if you have a nasty enough move set, they can be bit. Very soon though, pretty much after this tower, because we've already beaten Erika, we normally would do that after this. But very soon we are going to be on the level, but uh, yeah, maybe that will. I'm going to go and buy copious amounts of X items, once per year. Thank <laughs> you. 
No, I really need to follow the trip. So guys, get your guesses in now, what is the snark going to be? Let's see. Alright, let's talk trio. It's a Tauros. Fucking hell. We need to run the thing. Okay, you left me. Let's go. Self Cybeam. Yeah, definitely keeping fire buffs. Saving up for a rainy day. Needs to be. My end of running to like a victory battle out speeds me just spam spawn. Well that was the case, it's be fun. <laughs> I'd like to speed, then poke the flu. But then fire blast, make sure we won't trust it. Oh, this is gonna fuck me off. Oh my god, he knows a crit move as well. I can even like use Zex defend to get through it. We need to act speed first and foremost. Oh, useful thunder, let's go. Should be fine now. Extra fine now, they're damaging. Oh, I don't like a fable. It's so bulky, man. Make sure cover as well. Fuck you. Right. Sex attacker. Probably better hitting it through the physical side, I think. Oh, bone call can flinch. I always forget. Let's go. Big flinch. Uh. I don't regret using two axe attacks now, I don't know. We got the flint. Uh, let's go heal. We need uh, we still haven't picked up any ethers or elixirs actually for four, so we probably do need as many great gems as possible. And we'll have to be wise about what moves we use and when. Or just ensure that the like one or two shots by setting up as many X items as possible. Yeah, we needed Psychic PP. We'll run out. Oh, we can Thunderbolt Seedra. Still take a while. Nice switch though, for us. Fucking... Oh my god, I thought that was a crit. I just doubt that much. Alright, Koga, let's go. 
Once we beat Kogu, we can get the bad boost for the friend, which will help. Oh, fuck me. Taurus, I'll first. Such a good Pokemon, man. It's got an next attack on as well. Only Hornets are just too rough for that Mega Kick. Wow. And he's set up X Defense here. It will hit a decent amount of crit, so Tauros. It's a special route, of course it does. Oh, now I'm powered. Fuck off. Yeah, it's just GG. If you get if you use a full heal, it cancels your X items until you put another one on. And then they restore. It's fucking weird. Or like sometimes it does at least. We don't really want it to use Thunderbolt or just get any crit. Oh, says the crit. Fuck off. Smells potion. Oh, and another one. Good measure. Fuck off, man. Uh, I could maybe get away from three X defense on, but the first type of potion. Then we should be chilling. But we need to put X speeds on all sorts of shit as well. I need to sell a lot in this fight, man. We don't really want to see X attack on Taurus too. Or Thunderbolt. Could go go for risky and go with the X special. I think if it went for any physical move then, non crit I would have survived. Oh, that dealt exactly 22, we had 22 left. Okay, it was good to see. I've put so many X items on now that I might be able to uh, outspeed it still. No, we don't. Ah, oh, crit. I mean, I'm playing with Fire here to eventually going to get a crit. It probably is going to get a crit, like 1 in 5, 1 in 6 moves on average. This is tough, man. Go for the X specials from the start. Hope and Prey uses Thunderbolt a lot. It doesn't crit or paralyze me. There we go, it's the fucking crit. Uh, two X specials on X speed, maybe. And then we put the defend on. At the end of the day, I don't have to take this fight now, to be fair. We're going to do Rival 5 instead. Or just fight the trainers in his gym, get leveled. Try X Defend route again. One more. I mean, Mega Hicks 1 and 4 to miss. It's unlucky it's not missed yet. Either. Oh my god, let's go. Please don't crit me. Now an X Special, we might have a chance here. Which still outspeeds me? Fucking hell. I put all these boosts on. Alright, with the special drop, maybe I'll speed. No, we still don't. It hits the Mega Kick. It's still not crit me though. We're through, oh my god. So many boosts now, we might be okay. Unless I get crit again. I still don't outspeed Nidor at like Polywell. Fuck me, but how slow are we? I swear I put an X speed on, didn't I? Maybe it didn't. Drowsy's not ideal either, I need dex attacks for this fucker. Jesus Christ. Speaking of X attacks. I mean, if I do X specials on actually, Thunderbolt will still hurt it. Aw, oh, Karate Chop. If it crits, cuts through my X defense. No, it crit me. Oh, I was 1 HP, and I never would have been the last Pokemon. I was so set up. I did get a lot of luck there with the sheer amount of times I didn't get crit. Holy fuck, yeah. I don't think there's a point for taking this fight yet. I always like to try and get Kogra out of the way before Rival 5, because he does give you that defense boost. Um, but nah, that, that fight's way too tall.
Tauros complied, it was just spamming like hornets, I swear. Thankfully Tauros' moves aren't actually that good. It's physical moves anyway. I mean, Thunderbolt's powerful. The fact that I was fed nothing, even with an X speed, like 3x defend and X special, no, 2x specials, I think 3x defend and X speed is up there. That is very concerning. Oh, what would you know? We got hit by another thunder. It's not a great Pokemon. I mean, that might have been 1 in 256 cry shop missed though. Very fortunate. It's like small mansions to still squeeze out a decent time later on. Yeah, it's not good. All the no on that. It's too safe soon if we want to. It's much better. Right. See if this fight's any better, because if it's not, then these are the two like uh, mandatory fights than Ridge Wall. Oh, I'm not even healed. I really love speed, I'm a knife in the off. A bit close to it. I'm just gonna set up like specials first. Please don't paralyze me. Do not mind it spamming withdraw at all. Oh my god. Last potion. Still needs to have an X speed as well. Or maybe even two. I mean. Alright, we got like four X specials now, I think. And two X speeds. Surely we'll one shot them now. Barring crit. Probably this Thunderbolt, ponies are now rubbing a bone pub. Ah, oh, let's go. Nice. No, we hit the crit. Oh, thankfully, only small. So the crit's basically like the equivalent of me putting one X special on there, or four. The only reason um, Nidder Queen survived then. Let's go though. We got past the wall. Could fight Sabrina before Rock, uh, Koga. It's way too slow, huh? I reckon every second half of the game, fight, I'm gonna have to XP. We got to be Graveler though. Oh, and Bellsworth's not bad either, let's go. Um, I don't think there's a way I'm gonna be Giovanni. I've got no potions as well. We, are, we have, definitely have to like store up them too. But, there's a heal place in here. If I can beat one trainer. We go for here. I have a spare escape rope as well, I could always use that to get back heal and just come back in here. But yeah, let's we'll see if we can get through this. Oh, let's go. Oh nice. Perfect. So now I can heal. If I'd known that guy would be that easy, I'd have fucking done that before rival. I haven't really used that last potion. Thankfully, he had a Fero with typeless flying moves, of course, and he used the worst one. Okay. 
and even Wenger Sutton. Fuck, Wenger Sutton's not even that good in this game either. I think it's 35. Damage is probably like 65. Gen 2 onwards. Oh dear god. Uh, we, we definitely need the heal. I may even need X-Hangs for this, so I'll try anyway. If it's only using Bubble, we got a chance. It's just a trash move. Bear in mind, I have no potion. Oh, fuck. I'm gonna go for the freeze. I mean, you know what? I'm just gonna spam rest. Set up back sight, though. Still out me with max speed. Yeah, we need like two X speeds each fight. Feels like. Ah, oh, the classic bone club man. Oh my god. He's not perfect. Let's go. Fuck. No, oh, nice flinch. Yeah, no one. Oh, I'm dead. Ah, oh, I should have set up X specials, man. It's fine, this fight though, I don't even need the potion. Potion would be dearer than like, 3x specials or something, so I might as well set. Yeah, as long as I get through the Vaporeon, the Mew just seems free. Minimize is not ideal though. Oh my god, let's go, he's still hitting, but it allowed me speed, fucking annoying. Just need to hit it first, so I can actually go to sleep. Do another X speed. Yeah, it's a psychic move, and it's good AI in better comments. We'll tell it to just spam its psychic move. That is the good thing about being weak to psychic sometimes, when they have moves like rest and teleport and barrier, they'll just spam that. Same with amnesia as well. So, to be fair, Kogo is a problem, but it is obviously beatable, I nearly did it. Um, oh well, nearly got to his last at least, it would have been so. But so far we're through two of the three real problems in uh, Saffron. The last one is Sabrina. Sabrina's still not really been a major issue at all in this whole playlist. There's been times where she's been tough, taking a few goes, she's never really hard walled me. Or, you know, I've had to go elsewhere, something like that. But hopefully not the case today. She's got a vanilla team, or anything close to it. She'll be utterly terrifying. I've still got no potions, but I'm fuck it. I need to go fight. Aerodactyl will obviously have to feed me. Nice miss though. No, we're gonna lose this. I needed um Oh no, we have got a Mew, we can sell. Bro, Mew! Unexpectedly, it's such a welcome sight in this playlist. Uh, well, in the sea. Oh 
What's up, Tubi? Certainly at around this level, it seems it's the only psychic move it knows as well. If it ends up getting like... We could fight one at a high level, but then ends up getting psychic. And it is a problem. Some of that tank. Oh, I'm dead. If it does it again. Oh, let's go, it didn't. It's nice, we're through. Let's go, boys. Just 7 HP. I'd have set up more if any of the Snorlax was coming out. That was a good team on paper, it just didn't really. Of the AI to cause us too much problem, uh, too many problems. So let's go though. Another one down. Yeah, we could even do sub two hours. We can get through Koga. It's time to go and stock up on shit again though. No idea how much money we've got. Might have to just bite the bullet and sell a few TMs. We have taken wipes and uh, regret them now. That's not even going to be enough for the rest of the run for sure guys, I'm just buying this for now because I need to go and spend all my money now again on fucking hyper potions. Money is tight right now. Does it happen to do so many x items? I'm running into so many strong Pokemon though. Like, there's not been many like gimme teams in the tough fights. They've all thrown out like Dugong, Magma, Moltred. It's a fucking beast. Buy six hypers. It's decent. Anything I can sell? Not really. It's these TMs are trash. Yeah, it's all Mega Kick and Bubble Beam. And Psy Beam, actually. Let's go. Oh, that one was 2500. That one's two grand. Nice. They all sold for high. Perfect. Save a bit of money if we need any more excitements. So let's go. It's Koga. Hello. Um, yeah, I do need to fight Koga now. I was going to say, he, he allows you to sir. Um, so I'm locked out of fighting Blaine before I fight him. Is this still going to be really hard? I could always teach Fire Blast for this. That would be my most powerful special move. But I'm really happy with my Musa right now, and I kind of want to keep it that way. Of course, it goes for the Thunderbolt. Please don't crit me. No, it paralyzed me instead though. Fuck off. <sighs> it's just an extra turn I need to do. Full healing. And then put another x on. To restore. And there's the crit. See, that, no, that wasn't even a crit, but that's exactly what I mean. Look at how much damage that dealt now. Until I put another x on. That's why the paralysis just fucks you, and now it'll kill me. Now I'm start to restore. But it didn't matter, because I had such low HP. That fucking 1 in 10 chance of paralysis, man, is bullshit. That's the first Thunderbolt thing. This is definitely doable, though. I was setting up pretty well, and...
<sighs> Crit. Come on, man. You have three physical moves. A 7x defend, and then you thunderbolt. Paralyzed. Fuck off. What is this with the Thunderbolt Paralysis? Like, the 1 in 10? It keeps getting it. It's 2 out of 3 times, it's got it now and then It's bullshit. It's gonna hit a crit me soon. Just needed some Miss Mega Kick, please. There it is. Don't quit from near HP, it doesn't really matter. That's a crit Thunderbolt. It's time to attack. We still got spared and misses Mega Kick though. Crits this, I'm dead. Alright, nice. We're free to off, dude. We'll go like speed again on Holy World. Oh, please don't paralyze him. Nice. One in, it's like fake percent to paralyze the body form. That was terrifying. No, Drowsy could crack shop crit me. Doesn't, let's go. Okay, we're gonna see the last. Oh, it's fine as well. Fucking hell, I was that close to beating him before though. Browser has like 1 HP. And obviously Pidgey, piece of piss. I probably didn't even need X items at all to fight Pidgey. Ooh, oh, oh, that was a very good move, Crab Hammer. It almost always crits, so like, we're pretty slow, so I went to full advantage of that. Like Slash, but... I'm faster now than when I had Slash. Um, we're closest to 3 4 anyway, where I don't want to hit crits, because it'll pop in the X items. And to be fair, most fights now anyway do need X items, so. I don't think I'll teach Crab Hammer, but it's definitely an option. There may be a Maltrez coming up soon, which is fair out, and I can't really set X items, so I just need to Crab Hammer crit and hope it misses. Soon. Let's go. It's pretty big. Three star special. We are running three special moves. I'm trying to do more than bone floor. I don't even know actually, I might have to research that one. I don't even think it's more accurate. I can never remember.
Boomerang's power is 50, but it hits twice, of course. I think it is more powerful. Oh, it's 90% accurate. I think Bone Club 65, 85. So, I think we're gonna teach Bone around here. Bone Club 65, 85, yeah. Okay, let's teach Bone around. More accurate and more powerful. Let's go. It's not quite Earthquake or Dig though, I'm sure them. I feel like I've barely had Earthquake or Dig in this whole playlist, which is fucking insane. We just never find it, never learn them. But like on any Pokemon I'd pretty much consider teaching them, they're so good. Ground coverage is great on this game. The only way you can be super effective is Electric, and they're often problems because of their speed. Fire, there's a lot of poison Pokemon. Rock as well, super effective against. It's just OP man. There are so many poison Pokemon in this game. Gen 2 is going to be even better. It's super effective in steel. So we're in about an hour 36, 37. Look, sub two and a half hours, definitely possible here, guys. We shall see. We'll get harder and harder, of course, to set up our items. Uh, it would help if I heal for Blaine. Okay. This isn't the worst thing to come out against first. If you don't mind this. That's a new slash or something. Look, that's even with a crit. Farfetch is just not good, man. It's such a bad Pokemon. In my opinion. As far as, like, final stage evolution, it's one of the worst in the game, I think. Some power yeah, should use bone man to me off. Crit me, fuck off. I'd have the setup as well. I, I actually can't believe how little I have to setup then. I put one X speed on, one X special, one something else, and I'll spend them all. How the fuck? Is it one defend, one speed, one special thing? It did. I could set up even more if I want to in Farfetch, but evidently you can get away with that. Oh, there's the pra fucking the crit para. I knew it. Come oh, on, man. That's that's unfortunate. Farfetch's not particularly fast. No, it won't hit many crits. I'm not even sure we need next defend. Honestly, we get tank hits from this. As long as it's not crit. Man. It's got Typhus, Wing Attack there. I didn't mean the X attack. To be fair, I could bone around everything. Except Farfetch, but it didn't really matter with Farfetch. 
Anyway, let's just go. GG boys, let's go. It's looking like all the female knitter online have done a good run in. Pretty impressive. I love the moments of luck with all of them. Like Nidorina nearly be Nether King. Nether Queen comes to be Nether King. Uh, Neither one male would have a fucking task to beat this time. We're obviously not going to beat Nidorina. She did it in 151. We're on about 140 right now. Um, yeah, if I could manage to... Uh, I might even still manage to do this for two hours. If the first fight went out, a lot of these are easy. I can get this out. Um, but yeah, definitely sub two and a half hours was a target. I expected we'd do it between two and a half and three. Wouldn't have even been that surprised, and it may still happen if we do it over three hours. Sobro is type of psychic, so I'm not too concerned about this. Let's go. Uh, but yeah, like really, really good time. This I'm happy, it's definitely a fun. Largely aided to buy this move, sir. So it was very, very good. Oh, let's go. Sludge and smart, don't know, dude. I took risks there. But I wanted to see if I could get through the first time anyway, and uh, it would have been fine anyway. I could always set up on Cat P or Bloom. Didn't really have much to concern me. So, only level 45 for Giovanni, though. Normally, with a shit mob, uh, you're a lot higher level than this. Let's see if we can get through. Paris is gonna be fine as well. Let's go. I don't even need to speed at speed to speed this fuck. So I can do that one last. It's probably gonna use a special move on me. Yeah, it's like special. Oh, that's confusion though. I'm a bit wary of it confusing me. We don't want that, so yeah, let's just get rid of it. Seven to for now. Uh, not much better. Get rid of Venomoth. Oh well, let's go. I also have Venomoth then with the X Speed X Special combo, so. I'll we'll speed most stuff. Nice Fire Blast me. Oh yeah, this team was not good. All week to uh, psychic or ice beam until wiggly stuff. Wiggly stuff is a tank and it will take hits here. Yeah. Let's go. Nice. GG boys. Holy shit. Only six fights left for the big nidera. Female. Putting in work here.
What the fuck? I didn't mean to use the police, obviously. Oh, I should use next defend there as well. Don't want to. Oh, let's use dig. Oh, digs again. God, I really misfired this fight with my dad. That's not bad though. Charmander's definitely not awful to see old first. There's another baby Pokemon. And um, if it's digging, I can just set up two X Defend. It will spam dig now. It won't hit many crits. This will be fine. I just really fucked up that attempt then. Oh, it missed dig as well. I wanted 256 miss. Unlucky, Pat. Fucking hell, that's, that's so unlucky. No, oh, let's speed. So we've got one X special, one X attack. Let's put a second X special on. Ten miss, fuck. She just got my psychic open it. Oh god. I yeah, need to heal, but if it crits me, I'm so far. Nice potion use. Yeah, Talking out. Thank god that I can crit. I can't believe Golbat's still out to me. Maybe you should believe, it is fast to be fair. Nice, GG. Alright, this is gonna be one of the best, like, baby Pokemon. It's gonna be really hard to beat. Definitely for, like, any first stage of free evolutions. I mean, this is the first time we've done that. We've still not run any of the starter line. Any of the nine, which is insane. Because you think, well, given there's 9 out of 151, around 1 every 10 runs you'd expect one. Uh, well, around 1 every 15 runs, 16 runs. And this is the 40th today. Um, yeah, we've not run Pidgey, Poliwag, anything like that, any first stage, Ghastly, Abra. Uh, this is set in a pretty formidable time. The best pre ev we've done so far is still Voltorb. That's just two stage. So it's Sucker of a Fair. Oh, we run Oddish, actually, in chat. Oddish did alright as well, to be fair. In fact, yeah, we're not gonna beat Oddish here. Did it in like two hours. To be fair, we might. Uh, we'd have to do like a 10 mini for. I still need to go shopping as well. Let's get my upset. No, why not? I think Oddish had sleep powder or something. So, it basically had a cheese way of doing it. We have not had the cheese. Just had a really powerful move, so. Speaking of cheese, it's worth looking at this fucking TM then, actually, in case it is like the sleep powder or spore. Single lovely case. Oh, the phone club again. Nice one. Um. Hmm. I can need about six, seven of each, at least. Potentially, yeah. Uh, 
Let's see how many that gives me. 13 speeds, yeah, that's more than more. How many 11 specials? Like more specials. Maybe we chill now. We never did get any even though. Holy fuck, I just realised. Yeah, that's gonna be rough. We're gonna have to set it up so we can one shot most stuff now. Seven full heals, that should be enough. Alright, let's go! Oh no, to be fair, I've got a lot of TMs in my um, thing, computer, and I definitely need to bring them up. So, be seeing as we had no ethers. Fucking SS ticket. Waterfall, low kick, smooth and so drill pack, fire blast, blizzard. Right, let's do it! We've got about 35 minutes to do sub 2 and a half hours, which should be doable. So we shell the first hour, it's not too scary a Pokemon at all. Thunder Punch is scary though, in case you paralyze me. Let's set up 2x specials. 2x speeds. Oh, it's clamping me. That, nice, that's perfect. I can just spam X items while it's, this is stuck in there. Two X specials, two X speeds, one X attack. We've got on right now. We got soon ago a fight beam where I can do that instead of psychic. We got Blizzard as a backup. Job we save psychic, but hit my chance. Oh, still gonna live. Rapid Dash will let a lot crit so But just the fire spin, nice. Come on! Fucking foam rang, but it's missed chance. We're free though. And there's one left. Well, it's on a Weedle. GG. Nice. Not a bad team there for us to come up against. They went particularly fast. I probably didn't even need 2x speeds for anything other than the Rapid Ash. Um, but I'm glad I put them on because of it. I could even afford a foam rang mid. Yeah, maybe I should have sold Bone Club in that case, but once Bone Rang runs out of PP, we'll probably teach Drill Pet. Which is really powerful physical move. And more powerful actually. Um, it's probably gonna hit me for physical attack. It doesn't, but Mega Drain's fine. Let's go. Ah, oh, fuck off. Well, we're dead. Of course, it knows boom. <laughs> Normally, it knows self destruct. This one knows explosion. Fuck that. I'm gonna have to get rid of it straight away. No sound off and wheezing. I know side beam as well. Shit, man. 
in trouble here. He nearly one shots me. It's a complete range. Yeah, I need him to spam X defends on it, really. But Bruno does like doing that, he gives you chances. Or just have these bites on Mega Drain. Alright, let's go. No booming. Oh, the need to set up on it, really? It's a cadabra. Yeah, I'm dead. Crit me to a measure. I don't even get to live that anyway, even with an X uh, special. And it was its weakest psychic attack, basically. Uh, I think I just need to spam X defense. Maybe get to a point where I could live a boom. Do we live it with two on? Probably not. It's 250 power. Shit, man. Yeah, Bruno's gonna be slowing us down for a while, yeah, I think. Is there anything other than Cybeam? Boom. It's only one in 256 and this as well, it's not like I, I could teach fly actually, instead of boomerang and I just hope that it blows up while in midair, but then I can't get rid of fly of course, that's the only danger in it. I think I'll just try and get rid of it again and then let's see how we fare against Kadabra and up. Maybe I'd live Confusion 1x special, or maybe I can one shot of Boom Boomerang, I don't think so though. I'll try. But it only Mega Kick me. Still not dead. Oh my god, we got a chance. That's a crit me. Would I kill it with 1x speed? Not gonna risk it, let's just get rid of it. Blast so snow. Fuck me. Special. I need a lot of potions in this fight. Oh, it's locked into frash. That's good. It's a crit or something. So that's out 65. Next defend, we should live. Use next defend. And again. I can't remember how, like... No, it crit me. Fuck off, man. That was a chance. Ugh, that's so annoying. We had it then. We had it. We had a bit of everything on. I think we had at least one of each X item on then. Fuck off. That's so annoying. He looks to get through the wheezing and the Abra as well. I think we, I think last time we just straight killed the wheezing. A couple of sidekicks. If he X defends twice in the wheezing, that's the, the dream. And we two hit it with sidekick, which seems a range anyway. But last time I got a crit second time. Oh, I loaded a special and. The problem is Bite could always fucking um, drop the spec, uh, flinch me as well. Oh, it missed the mega kick. 
Now let's full heal, hopefully a hyper beams. Anything for confusion or whatever else it knows. Let's go, please don't crit this. Of course it did. Fucking course it did, man. Fuck off. Again, I was in there and I had a chance. Hello, it's special. Would I love a Cybeam? Uh, still not. Fuck off. Fucking food. Maybe the fly shot is the way. Fly will do less to Kadabra than Boomerang did though, I think. Maybe you can set up x items while you're in the air, actually, fly. As far as I know, fucking Gen 1. Oh bro, I haven't even got it on me, actually. Shit. I know to self should always bring fly into E4. Case of situations like this. Yeah, it's obviously dual, yeah, that's just frustrating, man. We did a really good time to get to E4. This is gonna be a long E4, I think. Is it a stupid fucking weaving cadaver combo? The bullshit crit of whatever that was to crit me before, I can't remember now. If we could just manage to get a crit psychic on Weezy, it'd be clutch. Or a quick boomerang on Kadabra. That looks like two it, yeah, I think I low rolled them. Oh god. Let's try and be cheeky, go for next speed. No, I think, of course it did. It didn't matter anyway, I mean it had me already. That's for sure, man. I got so close. Oh, it was like 1 HP on his fourth Pokemon. No, I could have just healed up. I had so many boosts. Fuck off. I still have luck on Kadabra the last few times as well. Oh my god, I know he's lovely kids. We live a hyper, as long as we can crit. Let's go. I'm weak though. If I knew he was gonna do that, I would have just gone. So now we gotta face his blast dice with no, no X items on at all. Oh yeah, keep using withdraw please. Thank you. Put the X defend on for Frash. No crits, please. Maybe even if I put another one on there and then just fear the crit. I think a crit will just straight kill me, won't it? Now we'll X special. One time. Oh my god, give me a chance. He's found X defends, so I time to get rid of the blaster. So we got two. I do outspeed it now. Still didn't one shot it. Oh, baby. Nice, it didn't crit me. Oh, yeah, the fucking Ivy Sword, and that's the cunt that crit me in it. Oh, I'm gonna risk it. Or heal. Oh, no, I resist grass, it's fine. Panic then, because of course Razor Leaf will always crit, pretty much. Oh, and then again! <laughs> like Koga, the last one's Piggy. That's fine. GG, finally. Yeah, that was a rough Bruno. I took about fucking 
seven, eight minutes at least, I think. Might not sound a lot, but in the face of these runs, it is. A bit of difference between, like, five placements. Oh, dear me. Do not want to run into anything first off that can explode again. Love of God. So I'd say I need to pay attention to the speed drops here. Psyduck seems fine though. There won't have too many crits. And all it does is special moves so far. Well, reflect fine. Oh, and Clancy Bell, let's go. This is an easy win. As long as I don't have too many crits. No one in. We're fine. Bro, I need to be careful actually. I've only got 4x specials left. For Lance and Champion. I think I just over put on. It's spam X attacks, I guess. Teach Joel Peck and Boma. No. No, he's still there. Uh, he can choose a type of strike. I had two X speeds on it still to have me. Persian will do the same. What a fast team this is. Oh, Persian will hit a lot of crits. Thankfully for us though, it was only solo demon. I'll do fuck all. Again though, a move that doesn't hurt, but how am I getting on spare by these fucks? Oh, we hit a crit. Non crit would have killed it. Let's go, let's shoot you there. Still on for sub two and a half hours though guys, maybe even sub two hours twenty. Which would be really good. About two hours six, seven minutes in now. So uh, definitely like between twentieth and thirty on the table at the moment. Fighting a Vulpix. You know what kind of move it's got. What's well, a skull back then? Let's go. That always give me two turns to sell. If it's doing that. Oh, no fun there. Let's get rid of this, I think. Ah, oh, the boomerang miss. Fuck off. Okay, it's fine. We're not a PP for boomerang though. Now let's set up an X special. Let's use some dig. Max defend. Fucking Ivy saw critting me. It's not even fast, man. It's twice. It's fucked me. After I've set up, but I probably ought to swept them. What the fuck it? I'm just gonna get rid of Vulpix. They can thunder me. I do not want to be thundered by them. Set up on Ivysaur. Can't have too many crits. Love of God. We've only got two extra fans on at the moment, I think. Put one more on. How's it dealt that much damage still? Fuck me. Alright, X speed. Need one more X defend then. Special. Hyper. I've only got three X specials. I'm gonna put two X attacks on. So I've got two X attacks, one X special, four X defense, and an X speed. Maybe one more X speed then. 
Um, let's play what? One more... Special. I think two specials should be enough for champion stuff. I could always put three X attacks on if you need to. We'll heal again. Take one more hit. Might as well do one more X attack here. I didn't plan on, but it's underground. Right, now we go. We should fuck it up now. Fuck up this whole team. Fuck it. I've set up really well then. Should be spun the ball then. Actually, no, it didn't matter if Ice Beam, because we're going to just teach you to So yeah, I've Tice Beam the whole team. We still don't kill Vile Plume. Fucking hell, man. Vile Plume is really good. That's the nice start speed, man. Yeah. GG. So I've only got two boomerangs and psychics. And ice beams. Oh. Well, it's time to do a whole new move set then. I'll save state before this though. We got a psychic for fireblast. Teach Drill Pack instead of Bone Run. The thing is, though, well, I, I got Blizzard actually for the Nido Queen. I was gonna say, I would not have a super pack in Yeah, Drill Pack, Blizzard, Fire Blast, Thunderbolt. It's all pretty fucking nasty, man. Let's face it. Need to heal. Alright, let's go. See, I've still kept the save state from before we did that. I actually made two then, um, just in case it was a mistake. Getting rid of like Bone Run or something. My run into Electric Pokemon just fucked me. I only got two X defense. Ah, uh, gives a confusion. Of course, it knows why are all these fucking random Pokemon no shit like this. It doesn't matter about the X special. He's again dead. Yeah, okay. I mean, we just need to get rid of Flickertongue. I feel like I might outspeed it. What level is it? Okay, we definitely don't. We're back special twice from the off. Might live. Yeah, I will. Although, I think it allowed me... Did it confuse me then? I'm sure I saw a bit of text. So there's both my X specials on. I need to get rid of it, it will end up confusing me. Fucking fire blast, man. Oh, come on, fuck off. How unlucky is that? This back to back fire blast. 15% chance to miss it. It's almost about 1 in 7 to me, so that's just around 50 to 1 that happens. Not quite 50 to 1, but a far off. I am happy we're up against just slow Pokemon first, though, than like a song. There won't have many crits at all. God, I bought a lot of potions, I did need a lot of potions for this shit. I've used over 10. There already. Yeah, I'm just gonna get rid of it again. Oh, the crit weakens it. Of course, I got a crit. Fucking hell. Fair, I'm not even sure I would have one shot anyone. Anyway. Could have been close. Oh, nice. Golbot would have outsped me for sure. What happened there? Golbot will have crits. Soon. No need to get rid of it.
Oh my god, we still got spat by Suga. Did I do one XP? I thought I'd done two, but actually I think I might have only done one. I don't know, I'm gonna need every last potion here. If it crits me once, I'm dead. And there it is. Fuck off. Of course. Of course there it is. Uh, so I've only got two X specials left to set up both and still can't quite one shot the Seedra. It looked like it was a range though, it's like 1 HP. Definitely been a tough beat for all this though. Been like over 20 minute E4 I think. I set up an extra X speed on a Licker Tongue though, compared to last time. Two X specials and X speed. The last time it was just two X specials and we got rid of it. We were worried about it confusing me, but uh, it just hasn't done, to be fair. Let's get rid of it now. Yeah, I find Gun Gold on Mirror Moving though. Let's go. Golbat seemed fine to self on, to be fair. Oh, egg bomb. No, oh, that's a range. Still don't kill it though. Oh, no slash. We're dead. Fuck you now, man. It's just gonna like crit me left and right, the stupid Seagra. Ugh. One slash and we're probably dead from full HP even. There's no point setting us to defend, though. Maybe I should set up X attacks to get rid of Seagra. Yeah, Seagra is a real problem right now. The first two aren't bad. I think I'll set up more on Golbot. It seemed fine. I can't remember what it did to me. It didn't do much though. Look at some is more of a problem. Still not confused me to be fair. We've had a lot of luck in our job. Still not crit me too. And it's also rain. Just dealt 43 damage. This is risky. Ooh. Fucking hell. 1 HP. Let's go Nidoran. The range is a bit like Tongue's attack, so working out really nicely though with the two X specials. Voice oh, unfolding. Now we get rid of it again. We'll set up Fair and Golbat, for sure. X attacks. Nice, you keep spamming mirror move, my friend. Your nose are raw, I was gonna say, I can lower your attack. Fuck's sake. Ah, oh, that's what I was worried about with Golbat. Oh, I did it again! Fuck off! That's what I'm worried about with Golbat, it's um, it's gonna crit soon. It's really fast. Uh, I think now we go. Took him one shot here, I need to be full HP for Seagra for a moment. Still out speeds, that's the problem, yeah, I just need another XP. Didn't I do two then? Maybe again I did one, I don't know. Oh, I hit the egg bomb, and then we've got next to defend on. We live though, let's go. Oh, yeah, it's a crit to me. I don't want it to lower me special.
Oh, we got the freeze. Right, never mind, guys. It's that's fortunate. It's the beauty of ice moves. Maybe we should have just gone for that from the off. To be fair, once you freeze, it's pretty much over. I can just sell freely. Go and switch out. So all the exciting to one here. Sell too many speeds. To be fair, I'll uh, be more likely to crit. I don't really want that. I just don't want to miss Blizzard on the uh, Nitto Queen though. That could be a threat. I obviously don't want to crit it. I wouldn't mind if a crit bolts or the Should be GG boys. And it is, let's go. Nice. Nice way to end it. We just got the freeze. I think we'd have gone on to win anyway, to be fair. We were pretty set up. We had like two X specials on my bolt. A couple of X attack boosts, because our attack did get lowered a few times by Golbot. Done! About 2 hours 20, 2 hours 21. Uh, really good. Not bad at all for a uh, baby Pokemon. Look at the fucking EVs. We had, we had a shit Nidoran as well. 0, 8, 4, 5. That's all of them up to 15. That was a really bad set of EVs. Our in game time was 1 hour 44, 36. Wasn't bad at all. Um, nice. Happy with that run, guys. What a great move set we had. And even like the TM options we had in the PC was so good. So now we shall see what we're going to be running next time. What is it going to be? Right, three, two, one, bam. Venonat. We've not run Venonat yet. Um, not a great Pokemon to be quite honest. We're Bug Psychic as well, so we told a lot of shit. I mean, this could be a rough run, um, <laughs> to be honest. Uh, no, we're not Bug Psycho, we're Bug Poison. Um, so we'll probably start with some really shit moves. We could start with like Twin Eagle, Smog, Poison Gas, or some shit. Sludge. Oh god, yeah, this one could be rough. Will we just Fire, Rock, Flying, Psychic, Ground. Although the Bug Side resists, so I think we actually are still weak to Ground. Just Gen 1 being Gen 1. Yeah, this could be a pretty grim one. This. What's its stats like? I don't even know. I know Venomoth is really good special. I don't think Venonat is. I think it's more physical. Nenipum's good more special. Yeah, it, that's the case for sure. It has 60 base HP, which is pretty good actually. 55 attack. But at the end of the day, it's still better than. I think that's a better attack stat than Nidoran. It has the same special stat though, 40. Bit more speed, 45. 50 defense. It's not awful, but it's not great. It, it's pretty comparable to Venom actually, uh, to Nidoran. And yeah, Nidoran female's attack was 47, its special was 40, its speed was 41. Our attack's 55, so 8 better. Our speed's 4 better. Our specials. Hang on. Yeah, our specials the same. Our speed's 4 better. We also have higher defense on HP, I think. Slightly better. It's about 5 better than Nidor on female in every area. Um, but weak to more shit. Uh, when it gets to a Venom off, it only gets 10 extra HP, 10 extra attack, 10 extra defense, but then doubles its speed and oh, 50 better special. 90 speed, 90 specials, good for Venom off. Um, so yeah, Venonas, I mean, what kind of level up rate is that? It's a Pokemon I don't feel like I know a huge amount. I don't think I've ever run Venonat in like vanilla. Uh, I don't even remember where the fuck you get it. Medium fast, it doesn't evolve until level 31 to be fair, so we don't have to cancel evolution like as much. That'll save time. Rival will end up with a Venomoth, which as you can see is so much better. Um, we'd be best sitting off like a rock slide or something rather than through special, because special is going to be like over double ours. 
Yeah, should be an interesting run at least. I've not run any of the Venu line yet. Um, never run them at all in this game. Uh, never even, you know, never run Venomoth. I think football could run Butterfree twice. Um, so yeah. That should be good. Uh, anyway, guys, in between episodes, I will, of course, go and uh, tally up the final time for the wrong female. I imagine it's about 25th right now, or 30th, or oh, like 40, so maybe even lower. Uh, we shall see. Ren and I think could have a task we can beat the wrong female time here. Definitely should be an interesting run. Um, we shall see, guys.